gates, and she has a place down on um, the end of Spenceville Road way out, about 10 acres, and she knows every single plant with a good flora, and she has a degree in teaching and psychology, and she's a freedom a food activist, I think. That's what I put that label on you. That's fine. And Whatever you say. She, she is first, first, first lady since Gianni Rome was playing here this evening. And we met because I met Gianni Rome when he and I were working, working with Richard Gill, the roving poet and medicine man from Rough Mary. And that's all I'm going to say, except you look beautiful. <laughs> As usual. As usual. Thank you. How about you, if you introduce yourself? My name is Mimi Gates and I live in Penn Valley just like Weldon was saying. I want to talk about the Stone House a little bit because I'm interested in what's happening in this area. And one thing that I want to recommend to people visiting or who live here or who otherwise happen to be passing through is visit the Stone House. There's another thing I want to recommend and that is come to the Fruit Jar Pickers on Sunday from 10 to 12. That's it, up and ready. But I want to talk about the Stone House a little bit. It's this big, monstrous building of stone Stone. It started out as a brewery about 10 million years ago, I think. I'm probably exaggerating here. 1852. And I'd love to do that. Anyway, it's gone through a number of different renovations, and nothing has ever really succeeded, except when Nico Wu got a hold of it, and now she has turned it into one of the most amazing one of the most amazing entertainment, uh, restaurant, activity, experiential um, types of events. And if anybody is visiting here, I really recommend that one thing you put on your calendar is visit the Stone House. It's in Nevada City. You can't miss it. And Nico Wu will generally be there in person to welcome you. Thank you so much. And who are you? Tell us. Who am I? Yeah, just tell us who you are. My name is Mimi. Mm -hmm. I'm, <clears throat> I'm a songwriter, plus a psychologist, plus a homemaker. Mm -hmm. My, uh, I've written a program that I hope to get aired on NCTV soon. It was scheduled to be aired before the breakup when uh, Paul Minicucci and, and Gail Women were kind of running the place. We scheduled the program, but the breakup came right after that, and we kind of lost, lost the impetus, lost the enthusiasm. But it's going to be aired very soon. But maybe now that things are going strong again, maybe we'll get it on. Yeah. Okay. Great. Hold on a second.